right over back at the wine mat. And we got KBS. Two, two, two. Signs of a teeter, no other signs. Where's the rest of it? That's off a teeter. Where's the teeters? I think I have found a new vehicle over there. It's been burnt out, but it's got wheels on it. I don't think I've seen it before. We're gonna go ahead and have a gaze at it. Yeah, the first car we have found in quite a while. Yeah, I think it is a Toronto. But yeah, no. Toast, of course. Had some really nice wheels on it. So, I went to check for a VIN number. Um, yeah, there is none. So yeah, first spot of the day. Quite a wreck, but it is something. So, if this is your Toronto, fuck. Righto, let's move on and see what else we can find. Righto, so I saw a vehicle that had its windows busted out, decided to come over here and investigate. So you're going to see it first time I see it. Check it out. So there's like five land cruisers just fucking sitting here. They've all had their engines removed by the looks of it. They've also had their transmissions removed. Holy fuck. Fuck. Righto, it's taking the boys out. Jim up. Yeah. Fucking first reaction. Oh, no we'll go this way. There's no fucking boot. <laughs> They're taking the door off. That's great. I love that. Oh, fuck, no, shit. fuck me, car. Fuck me. There's so many of them. Fuck me. Fuck me. Fuck me. Every single one. Okay. Hey. Yeah, let's see here. There you go. Toyota. So there's no plates on that one. This one is a 1997 Land Cruiser. That one used to be a 3 liter. That is a 95 4.2 liter. This one also used to be automatic. 1995 Land Cruiser VX Limited, automatic, and a 1996 Hilux Surf. This was a 1994 4.2 liter. That one is a 1996 and used to be a 3 liter. Not the monsoons! I love monsoons! Right oh, so we are back at the lot of vehicles. There are mostly Land Cruisers, however there are quite a few Hiluxes here. 
Now, apparently these have been here for well over a week. And people have came by, as you can tell, windows have been broken, other parts have been just ransacked. They've all been ransacked, really. Um, and, yeah, it's pretty devastating to see. Apparently one of them was nicked from up north, so I'm going to do what I always do. See if I can find some numbers, make some calls, and just try to let people know where their vehicles are. Righto, so I have found an invoice, but we do have a number, so I'm going to try and give it a buzz and see if we can get a hold of anyone. Are you missing a vehicle by any chance? Hello? Hello? I got no, um, the service is shit. I'm um, sorry to bother you, are you missing a vehicle by any chance? Would that happen to be a Toyota? Yup, I found it. Hello? He hadn't heard anything yet, so I'm the first person to let him know. And yeah, it is the owner of the surf. So I'm going to head out, get some better service, and try to show old mate at least where his vehicle is. We're heading back to the YMAC, track down the owners, and they are following me. So yeah, let's go show them the car. Yeah, now there's one, two, three, four, five. How long you had it for? Four or five years. Okay. Yep. There's two on their sides. Bloke on a dirt bike came up earlier and he said one of them, Jesus Christ, had um, been from Auckland apparently. Right I suppose that about wraps it up. I did hope you enjoyed this video. I do plan on sharing it to some Facebook groups and hopefully some of the owners of these vehicles will be able to find them. I did only manage to find one number, so with a bit of luck, get the word out there and yeah, find your bloody cars, mate. Anyway, I'm CRO. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. I'm out. Peace. Oh, I can't see shit. Oh, I gotta get out of here. Hey, I can see better on my phone than I can in person. Hold on, I'll use the phone. <laughs>